Hey guys, Mr. Master Jedi here from the Star Wars figure review. Time to give you a look at the power of the Force on the Baba. Here's the card he came in. I really am such excited about this card because it's a foil card. You can see the foil picture of the Baba. On the back, it's very similar to the Tuscan Raider card. It's a little stats. And this is, this figure is about, this figure is as old as me, 1996. Uh, the other figures in the line had the Atlantic Kyle Rizian and Skiff Guard Disguise, Bit Fortuna, Emperor Palpatine, Luke Skywalker Stormtrooper Disguise, and Bosk. So, first cool. Then they had the Luke's T16 Skyhopper and Electronic Rebel Snowspeeder. Cool little look at those old figures. Now, I'm going to tell you the story of how I got this guy. Uh, in my Royal Guard review, I told you that I was going to order this guy. And I got it from an app called App Trailers. And what you do, you watch trailers. You watch trailers for apps coming up, and you get points. Now I had the code here that I was gonna give you guys. And what you do, you watch trailers and stuff, and you get points. And when you get a thousand points, you can get a one dollar Amazon card. It's currently the rewards cycle through. It's currently not in the rewards right now, but it should be back tomorrow. But uh, I got a lot of stuff. First thing I got was Panda Baba. He was five dollars off Amazon. Uh, yeah pretty good. The code I'm going to give you guys, this will give you 50 points towards it. The app is called App Trailers. It's free in the App Store. The code is N-H-O-J-N-O-N-A-R. And that code is my username on the app. You enter that code, it's going to give you 50 points, and it's going to give me 1,000. I know it comes in, it's, it's going to get probably thinking, why do you get 1,000 and I get 50? It's because it's giving me credit for suggesting the app and trying to get the app out there. So, and if you guys enter those codes, I'm going to be able to get more figures and do more reviews. So I know a bunch of my friends helped out with helped me out with this. So thanks, guys. And I got Ponda Baba. I actually ordered a new airsoft gun, which is a pistol, or that. And I'm just waiting for the world to come back and I get a speed loader. So that's about five nine. That's twelve dollars worth of stuff. From an app that's free and it's really worth it so again code nhj nhoj n-o-n-a-r good code app app trailers free in the app store okay now from that that little digression uh here is the figure here is ponda baba now see i wasn't really a big fan of ponda baba from the movie, I mean, yeah, he was the guy who tried to mess with Luke in the cantina, but I really liked him in Robot Chicken. You search Robot Chicken Pond Bob on YouTube, it's a hysterical sit the skit they did. So, accessories wise, it does come with his blaster pistol, which I'm warning you guys if you get this, there's tape on the blaster pistol, and you have to like wash it to get the stickiness off it, and it also comes with this rifle, which is kind of weird. But, you know, fitting his other hand, I don't know why you want to have a rifle. You can either, see, either put it in his hand, or what I like to do if I'm going to have him, is I just take the sling, and I just put it in his hand like that. Pop, pop. So, I'll take the rifle off him. You know, this is a hot display, at least. I'm just playing with his gun pointing out like that. Articulation on this guy. Articulation on this guy. He has the slightest swivel head, swivel shoulders, no articulation elbows or wrist. He has swivel waist and swivel legs. He has no articulation knees or ankles. But he's still a pretty cool figure. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of weird names going on for this guy. I call him Ponda Baba. My family tends to call him Ponda Bum Face because. Exactly. They called him, he was originally called Walrus Man when he first came out. Then they later named him Ponda Baba. But. Yeah. Now, see, he looks more like a spider to me. Like, how some spiders have those fangs, the puffed out fangs. He looks more like a spider. Especially with the two big eyes and the, uh, all the hair around his head. He looks more like a spider than a walrus. This figure does not have the hands that they had in the vintage figure, which had the, almost like a, uh, flipper and these are just hairy paws kind of things.
But anyways, very cool figure. I'm happy to have him in my collection. So, uh, yes, this is 50 Mass Jedi. May the Force be with you.